I will never, ever, ever trust another person. Robin Hands will forever have her guard up. Her faith in others is tarnished. The Amherst woman paid a $400 deposit for a teacup Yorkie, a puppy she would never receive. She realizes now it was all a scam. It's just not right. She came across Kimberly Teacup online. Hands fell in love with this one, Deborah. She made contact with the seller on Monday. She asked for a deposit. I was a little leery. She says, I've been doing this for 25 years. Hands was scheduled to pick up Deborah on Tuesday, an hour away in Shreve. On the way there, the seller wanted the remaining balance of $600 before the dog could be handed over. I said, no, the puppy needs to come out first. I want to see it. She finally pulled up to the address given, a blue and white home. Hands waited a while before a woman came to the car. Are you here for a puppy? And I said, yes. She said, well, you've been scammed. Hands tried contacting the seller again. They actually blocked me. 19 News called Shreve Village Police Department. The chief says he wasn't aware of a puppy scam until we told him. I feel that it's a scam, but I will continue to look into it. And Robin isn't the only person who showed up to this house wanting to get a puppy. We talked to the woman who lives here who says this has been going on for several months. They're coming here and I don't know these people. Bottom line is they're blaming me for it. I had nothing to do with it. Defense Callie Selder says she's afraid to even let her dog what out. What if they're mad because they didn't get a Yorkie puppy and they think I'm involved? Are they going to steal my dog? As for Hans, she hopes her loss will save others the heartache. The reason I'm doing this is because I don't want other people getting hurt. In Amherst, Winnie Dorch, 19 News.